first quality that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says قَدْ أَفْلَحَ الْمُؤْمِنُونَ الَّذِينَ هُمْ فِي صَلَاتِهِمْ خَاشِعُونَ They are humble. The morality is number one. Even in your prayer, in your connection to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, being a humble person is very important. This is a good lesson for all of us. That our relationships must be based on morality. And what is the roots of morality is being humble. Being selfish is rejected in Islam. How can you, you how come you can be a good humble person? By having patience. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala states in the other words of Quran, in Allah ma'as sabirin. Allah is with sovereign, with patient people. If you're patient, God is with you. If you're not patient, God is not with you. Because that time, whatever we do is not with the permission of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. What will happen? All these verses of Quran are for all, for all of us. These verses are for us to recite and to practice it in our personal life. What is the problem with us? The problem with us is only reciting the, the verses of Quran. But the recitation of the verses of Quran is only one side. The other side is practicing these verses of Quran in our personal life. The reason that Imam Fazin alayhi salatu was salam is stood up against Yazid, against injustice. What was that? Because Yazid was Fasiq. Yazid was someone who had no connection with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And he was claiming that he was the leaders, the leader of Muslims. So the leader of the Muslims must be qualified must be accepted by Qur'an and Ahl Bayt. Now, the quality of a mu'min, of a believer is praying but with humbleness. The, the second, وَالَّذِينَ هُمْ عَنِ اللَّغْوِ مُعْرِضُونَ What is lagu? Lagu means wasting time. Anything could be lagu. It could be watching TV for, for like 10 hours. That could be lahu. It could be talking without any result. Without, some, some talkings are really for no reason. Just we talk for, for no reason. Just we say something that it even is not needed at that time. Talking so much will make us commit sin because we don't know sometimes. Sometimes these talking will change to riba change to backfighting or something like that. Sometimes some of these talking will change to cursing someone, insulting someone. So lago means wasting time. Mu'min never tries to waste his time. Mu'min is a smart. A believer is a smart. He uses his time in a good way. وَالَّذِينَ هُمْ لِلزَّكَاةِ فَاعِلُونَ They give charity, helping other people, poor people especially. وَالَّذِينَ هُمْ لِفُرُوجِهِمْ حَافِظُونَ إِلَّا عَلَىٰ عَزْوَاجِهِمْ أَوْ مَا مَلَكَتْ أَيْمَانَهُمْ فَإِنَّهُمْ غَيْرُ مَلُومِينَ فَمَنِ اِبْتَغَىٰ وَرَاءَ ذَٰلِكَ فَأُولَٰئِكَ هُمُ الْعَادُونَ The only relationship which is accepted in Islam, in Quran, narrations and ahadith is marriage. Mu'min only accept one relationship, which is marriage. Establishing family, making a good family, having kids, bringing love in a family situation, loving each other. This is what Mu'min wants. But unfortunately, what we see right now, around us, the marriage age is going up. Why? Because we have some explanations that those explanations are against Islam. You should have this much money. You should have this beautifulness. 
you should have this degree. You should be in, from that kind of family. You should speak that language. You should be from that nationality. You should be this color, that color. No. Islam says no. Inna akramakum indallahi atqakum. As soon as you see someone who has taqwa and girl and boy are happy with each other, this marriage must be performed. Money, facilities, nationalities, race, all these things are made by us, not by Quran. <laughs>